Hello, welcome to our YouTube channel. In this video, we will show you how you can update Instantio Pro WordPress plugin. As you may have already know that this update is a major update. We have merged the free version with the pro version. And uh, this is for a long term future, so hopefully you will like it. Um, so let me show you how you can do it easily. So first of all, you need to go to plugins, click add new. And then you click upload and you click browse or you can just uh, drag and drop the downloaded plugin file and you click install now. So once you click install, you will see that this new version is 2.1.0 and you click replace current with uploaded. Now if you go to back to the plugin installer, you will see this notice that Instantio Pro requires Instantio Lite to be activated. So you click install now. Then you just have to install this plugin. And you click activate. So that's basically it. Now if you go to your options panel, everything should be as is plus you will get few extra options here and if you also go to your shop page and you see that this cart is also now don't panic if you see the red button we are we were just playing around with the plugin so if you go to the design tab you will see this panel background color if you turn it to white you click save and the panel color is now white as it is uh, in our next update we will send we will give you the ability to fully customize style this whole cart so we stay tuned for the next update now i can also show you uh, about the feature of the free version or what we have done in this version so if you turn instant Your pro off you will see that this free version is now available now what the free version is you click save and if we go to shop shop now again so this is basically the free version you click checkout now and you go to the checkout page directly and you can also change the url of the checkout if you say say facebook.com this pay this button will go to facebook.com basically and all the options of the colors can be customized from here so this is basically it let me know in the comments or in a support forum if you face any trouble with the installation thank you